Hi, welcome to my channel, Breeze Butterfly. Today I have a message from Spirit for Fire Signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or anyone drawn to this message. And I'm getting the channel song every day is exactly the same by Nine Inch Nails. You've been in stagnant energy here where the whole lot's not been going on. You've been working on you. And it feels like the same thing's happening over, like you can't get ahead or something. Like it's not changing, but it is changing. Changes are coming to your, to your routine. Because you've been doing the same routine here for some of you. Because you have a purpose. Yes, you have a divine purpose here that you're working on. That you've stepped into. And because of this, you're going to have a new beginning. And you're hoping and wishing for something to change. And it's about to. Some of you are speaking, speaking something, talking about something. There's talk here about someone that's been very silenced here talking about you because you've achieved something. You've achieved something. What you told you, what you said you were going to do. A whole community of people are watching you and they really want to come around to you. This is kinship. This is like soul tribe. People watching you. High vibing ones too. And they're about to change things up here for you. Yes, you're very influ influential. There's three people involved here that you're letting go of. That you're dreaming of. That you're dreaming of. Something that you love. That caused you that caused you a lot of pain. So the main energy is force. Of, or source. Source is forcing something to end here. That, about someone that's watching you. In the negative the angel number 44 is really sticking out to me. But you're completed something here. You've achieved an award or you're about to. And it's going to make you extremely happy. Let's see. Yeah, someone's playing pretend here with you. Good vibrations. You're in very high vibes, let me tell you. And there's a dirty cop here. We have a dirty cop that's, or if it's not a cop, it's some type of law person or several here that's being shook down. There's light. There, it's being exposed. Because they were doing something over and over here that they should not have been doing associated with someone in your household or someone that you know. Something like that. Yeah, they had no love for you. None. This person's been pretending a whole hell of a lot. They told me to take them on. Something was done in Vegas or on a trip against you here. It could have been on a birthday, someone's birthday, but it don't have to be. It's just sticking out to me. Okay, let's see. What do we have? Someone's finding you very attractive here. I don't know if that's what I'm getting. Someone's found you. Someone's been looking for you that they found you. Yeah. And they're going to be left behind. They're going to be left behind. This person coming towards you. They want to get someone in on the inside. On the inside circle. It's going to be in big trouble here. Yes, there, gonna be, there will be blood. There will be blood. This clown you're dealing with here. So I'm getting, it's been a while by stained. It's been a while since you have talked to this person or seen this person. That wants to come back around to you. Yeah, they're holding on to you to dear, for dear life. But you're going to, they're going to, because they were without you. They're without you. They want back in, but they're in devil energy. But you're holding your head up high in this situation. You are. You're standing your ground. Because you've had enough. Yes, you've had enough. And someone's madly in love with you here. Who you've had enough of. You don't want them back in. No, you don't. Some of you are looking for new love. Or new love's coming towards you. Yeah. Friends in low places. This person's in extremely low vibes. And it's been a while. They want to call you. They want to call on you here. I'm trying to get a hold of you. Or they're going to come and talk. They want to come and talk to you. They do. They're reminiscing you. They are. Very nostalgic. This crazy bitch you've been dealing with. Or asshole. Who's a fucking clown that you've had enough of. That fucked up. Majorly fucked up. They're associated with someone that's a parent figure that also, like, that, that's going to face consequences that you're dealing with here in your household. Major consequences here. And you've had enough of this shit, and so has the law. Because they went beyond here. They went, they crossed the line many, many times. Yeah. 
If someone's very addicted here to something coming towards you, they are. They're going to act a fool, too. They're going to say they still love you. Yes! They're going to come and tell you. Some of, a few people's going to come and say that they love you here. You're going to get some love confessions. Yeah. And there, someone's going to disappear from your life completely here. That you've had enough of. Yeah. Because you're a sweetheart. And someone, like I've already said, is madly in love with you here. That is in deep, deep regret for hurting you. Yeah, because all the times they fucked up with you. Yeah. Yeah. They want a reunion here. And someone wants to work with you here. Someone that's going to face consequences. They can't work with you. Cause some of them are going to go to prison here. And they're already in very bad health. For stealing your fortune here. Yes, for stealing from you. A whole hell of a lot. They're studying you. Some, a few people studying you. That, and they're talking about you too. And how this motherfucker, assholes, bitches, whoever that you're dealing with here. Try to kill you off. Yeah, someone you was in a commitment with. For someone you worked against you for a very long time. And now they're going to go away. And you're going to hear about this. Yeah, it's a huge surprise to them. Huge one. That they're going to fucking prison. Mm-hmm. And it's going to bring you peace. Very. And it's going to be... You're going to receive a gift, too. Their judgment... Their their imprisonment is a gift to you. Yeah, this foe has been working against you here. You already know this, though. You do. That they're about to lose every goddamn thing. Everything, including their freedom. For some of them, their lives. Yeah, you're waiting for this. You are. Biding your time. Working on you. Perfecting you. Mm-hmm. And your skills. And it's been a while. You've been waiting for a while here. You have. And someone wants to romance you here. Or you want to romance someone new. Yeah. That ain't it for everybody. That's for some of you. You're remembering everything this past person did to you here. You're you're going, like I've said, you're, you're reminiscing about all the times they fucked up with you. All the things they said, all the things that they did, and some of the shit didn't add up here. And you know this. Yes, you know this. This person's not available to you. They're They're completely blocked off. They've ghosted you, and now you're going to ghost this. It's the best thing that could have happened to you here, and you're realizing this. It's like a blessing in disguise. I will wait for a sign from you. You're receiving signs about this person coming back around here. And you're bearing, you're working on you. You've completely, like, forgot about, you're about to forget about this person. You, you completely, you already did forget about this person. Yeah, you're not available. You're very hard to get. This person can't get in your... Can't get you anymore. But they want to get close to you. Yeah, they do. And everything's reminding them of you here. But you healed. You completely healed. Yeah. It was hard, but you fucking did it. You did. Self-love, baby. Self-love. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this person wishes they could have treated you better. Wish they treated you, be treated you better. And they're watching your pretty face. Yeah. On whatever it is that you do. And they get lost in your eyes here. But, but they lie to you. A whole hell of a lot. They're very, very cold. And that's why you're leaving them. Mm-hmm. So I'm getting train. Calling all angels. You're definitely praying here. Calling on your angels, your ancestors. Whoever it is that you pray to. And they hear you here. And they know that someone's crossed many, many lines with you. And they're about to leave your atmosphere for fucking good. And someone's looking up to you now. Who's drowning in emotions. This fool that's took too many chances. Who who left. They're coming back. Yeah, they're coming back. If someone wants to celebrate here with you. In a safe place. Someone wants to take you to a safe place and celebrate with you. Some of you are going to be world renowned. Angels are helping you with this. They're helping you. This is part of your purpose. Part of your destiny. Because you are an angel. Let's see. What do we have? Yes. Your angels are, are helping you leave the situation. Removing these people from your life. Yes. These sneaky people that's been doing dirty shit to you in the dark. It's all coming to light. They're going to have to give up. They're going to have to surrender here. Yes. They're being cut completely out. The Queen of Swords. Cut completely out of your life. 
because they wouldn't stop doing what they were doing, hurting you over and over, the Three of Swords, staking you in the heart here. Yes, someone from your past. Someone from your past who you're standing up to. The Strength card. And you're receiving signs of something here. I'm coming back. You hear my throat? The quit of the wicked, they're messing with your throat chakra here. They're doing dark magic against you. A whole hell of a lot of it. Queen of uh, Wands here. Yes, a whole lot of wickedness. Over your bed, too, for some of you. Messing with your bedding as well. So you can dream weird. You know what I mean? That ain't for all of you. But you're about to be rescued from this situation here. Because an angel is watching over your household here. They have been for a very long time. They see how you've been defending yourself. And they're coming to defend you. Yeah. And they stole from you. They stole something from you. Ten of Pentacles. Someone in your household. A wicked magician. Yeah. Working together. Drinking, too. A lot of them are drinking together. Mm. But you're about to have balance in this situation. You're going to go celebrate. Some of you could be drinking champagne. Yeah, this person you was married to or in some type of commitment with, if it wasn't a love marriage, it was some type of commitment. They've been lying a whole hell of a lot. They're coming to kiss your ass because they're in distress. Complete distress. They can't sleep at all. They can't get out of their head. No. <laughs> they have a heavy burden that they want to release. And they're going to tell you all about it. They've been trying to conjure up spirits here, too. They've been trying to get dark angels to work against you, but it ain't working. No. And that's the motherfucking truth. It is. Yeah, they're doing candle magic on you, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but you have angels high, like seraphim and shit surrounding you. You do, because you're very wise, and you're about to get a, a huge offer. Offer. And someone's going to have to give up everything that they took from you. Yeah. So that's what I have for you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, donate, wishlist, all that stuff. Until next time. Later.